Hey guys, my name is Moon and welcome back to another episode or another reaction, I mean, to The Eminence of Shadows. So today we're going to be doing the third episode. So last time, uh, Kagino, uh, yeah, he reincarnated, right? We now know his name. His name is Sid Kagino in this world. So Sid, Sid or Kagino is pretty much the same. But yeah, he has a group now called the Shadow Garden and he is their lord, Shadow, right? And... He also found this girl that was kind of like a monster, technically, right? A blubbery mess. And then she returned back to normal, and she, he named her Alpha. I guess everyone is named Alpha, Beta, Gamma, something like that, right? In his group, there's seven of them. And then I think they believe that they're descendants of heroes or something. That, But I would not be surprised if it actually <laughs> became true, right? Because last time, I think the Cult of Diablos is also true. I think it's a myth in this world, the Cult of Diablos he was looking at. But then it is actually true, I suppose. But yeah, uh, let's do the third episode. Let's start it. Let's go. So are we going to time skip now? Yeah, but yeah, I remember uh, last time they said that the Shadow Garden uh, ladies are going to live, right? Or leave, I mean leave. They're leaving. Yeah. They went away. Maybe not. Maybe they actually are going to look for the cult, right? Magic. Why is this back then, or like I said, this is back then? He's training. <laughs> okay, that's how he died. Okay, he died like that. Are you stupid? <laughs> Okay. So I guess he's uh 15 now, right? Because uh Fencer Ordinaire, the third episode. When you're 15, you go to a academy, Midgard Academy, if I'm correct. But background character A. <laughs> oh, her his friends. It's Connie. Connie. <laughs> Kel and Paul. I kind of like this uh, approach to the show. It's not, what do you call this? Not sure it's violent and stuff like that. But there's humor in it. I mean, there's a little humor in it. Like, look at this. Yeah, I mean, it's not just like super, super serious show is what I mean. And I love it like that. Ooh. 
like acne. Alexia. God, it's a free campus. Denied. <laughs> I mean, I guess all of them are nobles, right? So, yeah. So imagine if she accepts Sid Tagano. Okay, what is he going to do? Well, he's nervous, though. <laughs> he's very nervous like this. Rimless. He's so con. He's super confident earlier. Oh. What? She accepted. Huh? <laughs> Wait, that was a twist. What? <laughs> Everyone is watching him now. <laughs> there is a catch, yes. Sweet memories. Oh, the princess. Oh, everyone is uh, looking at them. Damn, she has her own maid in school. <laughs> Lower class options. Sorry, sorry. She likes it even more. Where's his sister, by the way, right? Isn't her sis isn't his sister, I mean, in this school as well? Yeah, like uh Princess looks like or Yeah, kinda like his sister, right? The way she looks, I mean. But let's see. Mr. Xenon. Okay. Okay, he's uh training with Princess. Hmm. 
Yes. <laughs> it's bland. But he's w much, uh, what? What? What is that? Oh, okay, they're betrothed. That's why. Okay. That's why she wanted him here. <laughs> okay. Oh, but yeah, maybe, uh, maybe she'll really like him. <laughs> I mean, they thought that you're going to deny him. I mean, he thought, I mean. And then she's going to actually like him as the series progresses, right? What is that? Coin? Wait, is she throwing him money? What? Well, you're right. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> He's acting like a dog, you know. What is that face? Fido. <laughs> I had I had my eye on her too. Is that Xenon? No, I thought it was in a teacher, an instructor. Why is he there? Fido.
<laughs> Insult and spite. Why she wants to show the people that she has a boyfriend? Like all of the people now, I mean, not just school. Yeah, he got everything. He, he finishes ice cream so fast. Totally average, full of flaws. Oh, another. How much is that worth anyway? Two more weeks. Okay. And then what happened? Can we see Iris? We only saw her back. Ordinaire. Ordinary. Silence. Oh, Iris is there. Violence of scum. They're going to fight for you. Is it over? I mean, uh, the boy, the boyfriend phase is over now. Damn. I mean, you just go back to normal. <laughs> the 
They're blushing. <laughs> the hell are they talking about? Okay, what is this now? Oh no. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, he could fight them if he wanted to, but of course he's not going to do that. You can't be doing that. Okay. So, yeah. Dude, I love this show. For some reason. It is very enjoyable. <laughs> I don't know why. Like what prompted this but yeah it was very enjoyable from the first episode like in the beginning i thought it was gonna be like super super serious show right because yeah episode one kidnapping and stuff like that but now we're here in episode three we're having humor jokes it's nice that uh the show is like that it's not uh super focused on all the i mean sure it's uh like the drama and all but what I mean is it has humor in it, yes, as I said as I said earlier in the beginning. It's I like I like this. I like this. So yeah, if you have, I mean, if you have any recommendations, a show like this as well. If anyone is watching. I mean no one watches my videos, but yeah, if if someone is actually watching this and you have any recommendations, shows like this, not even technically Isekai. We have fantasy. I like fantasy shows. Yeah. You could recommend it. I, I might check it out uh, later on. But yes, we're done with episode 3. Kagino Sid is kind of in a predicament right now. As Princess Alexia is missing. <laughs> she didn't go back home. And we're going to find out what happens in episode 4, right? Uh, so yeah, we're just going to continue this and do more in the next one. So I'll just see you then, guys. Bye-bye.